Hey y'all, it's Zuri Hall and I got my first ever microdermabrasion treatment right here in New York City at Dr. Norman Rowe's office and uh, they gave me a treatment and I decided to vlog it for you guys so you could check out the entire experience. Oh my gosh, super excited. You guys, do you see where I am right now? Dun, 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 dun. I'm in a doctor's office. So I'm at Dr. Norman Rowe's office and I'm about to get this skin fixed. We're gonna do microdermabrasion. I've never done this before, so I'm really excited because I've wanted to do it for so many years. I have so much, not so much, but enough like hyperpigmentation on my nose, like above my eyebrows, like just little dots that come from picking and all that stuff and I've always had acne. So we're gonna do a microdermabrasion to sort of straighten that out and get me looking all new and dewy. And then I think, what's it called? I think the doctor explained it to me as Dermablend. I'm gonna ask her when she comes back in. But you know the peach fuzz? Is it Dermablend? Dermaplane. Dermaplane. <laughs> it's Dermaplane, I'm making up terms. So I'm gonna do Dermaplane on the side where you see like my peach fuzz, all the little fine hairs. The, the professional term is Villa? Correct. <laughs> I'm learning things, you guys. So this is Villa, and we're gonna get all of that gone. I had no idea that this was even a procedure, so I'm really excited. And then me and my mustache that you guys see all the time. So that's gonna go too. But anyway, so we're gonna do that procedure. I'm gonna take you guys through it, and you can see for yourself what it looks like. So I'm excited, yay. This is their high-tech stuff. It's called Derma Sweep. So that's what they're gonna be using. To, um, get my skin all pretty. So apparently the first thing we're gonna do is clarify. The clarify and that'll be for like the bits of acne that I get and then spot treatment and then I don't know what's gonna happen. <laughs> we'll see what's next. So you tell me when? We'll go ahead. Yeah. <laughs> it's such a funny feeling. It's interesting, right? Yeah. Feels like a little vacuum on your face. Yeah, just like sweeping it through your So this is literally all it takes. Like this is the actual microdermabrasion happening right now. Yes. Doesn't hurt, right? I, that's what's blowing my mind that I waited this long to do it because I always thought it would be super irritating. It's not. But I feel like I put my face through worse <laughs> just on a daily <laughs> basis myself. They're gonna show me what they just sucked out of my face with the microdermabrasion. Oh. oh my god! Started off as this color. Yeah. And, look and that's off. everything from out of my face, you guys. Don't judge me. So they're using the blade to scrape off the hairs. You can see. And it does not hurt at all. It literally just sort of feels like if you were shaving, but more comfortable because I'm always nicking myself when I shave. But really, the effects of it are not the same, right? Because it, does it doesn't grow hair. back thicker or anything like that. You look at all that. It's been on my face my whole life. <laughs> I'm parting is such sweet sorrow. It's hair and dead skin. And dead skin. <laughs> Look guys, all of the baby hair, the peach fuzz is gone now. I literally have never felt this layer of my skin. There has always been hair here. It's gone here, upper lip, even the sides where it sort of grows into my eyebrow. So smooth right now. We're talking like baby bottom smooth. It looks really, really good. I love it. This is the infusion, guys. This one actually feels really good. It's like a cooling effect or something. It feels cool. Yeah. This will help with acne. Oh, good. And also to prevent it. Okay. And this is the spot treatment, which is a lightener for the bigger spots you guys saw, like above my brow and then my nose. You guys, I'm all done. It looks great. I wish you could feel my skin. It's so smooth, like seriously, so silky. I'm bummed that Matt is back in Europe now because he won't even get to see 
<laughs> that the beard he loves so much, I'm just kidding, the peach fuzz, is gone. But um, yeah, so like she was explaining to me like some of the dots she lightened a bit and then over time they can completely fade as I continue to do checkups and continue to come in for my visits. But seriously, like the immediate difference is crazy. Like I, I'll, I'll let you guys see it once I go out to the sunlight too. But super smooth, all of those hairs gone now. All right, you guys, so this is the aftermath. It's been about, it's been a couple of hours since I had the microdermabrasion and the extraction and the derma, what was it called? Derma whatever. So um, yeah, this is it in the sunlight. Like, and of course, like she said, the spots will continue to fade over time as I continue to get uh, my checkups or follow-ups or whatever you want to call it. And uh, she said that, you know, as many as like four, I think maybe four to six sessions will do it. And um, I think, yeah, in person you definitely get the, uh, the difference. So again, no makeup except I've just got my brows and then like some eyeshadow and mascara. But like here, nothing, 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 nothing. Nothing. Shout out to Marilyn. She's the one who did the microdermabrasion for me, and I really like it. Really excited. I got to start working on my skin, and I got to start washing my face like three times a day because with all this makeup layered on, especially when I'm on set, it starts to take a toll. So there you go. Leave a comment. Let me know if you would or wouldn't try microdermabrasion, or which part you think you would do, and which part you're like, whoa, I don't know. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys later.